Hey y'all, Trader Joe's is very overstimulating. I just, I'm just looking for peaches. Very, very overwhelming. I got like four, four things of peaches. And this is all that I want. My coworker had these today and I knew that she needed help opening them because they're so fucking hard to open y'all trader joe's peaches are so hard to open and then i randomly got some garlic bread that i'm gonna use at some point probably just for the bread i don't see myself having it with anything else i've been like just trying to be still be still be still be still y'all I am on my way to Five Guys because I have been emotional all morning. I've been holding it in because, of course, like, I got to go to work. But I have been, like, just wanting to cry. Um, just wanting to cry. And, and, and it's all, like, it's a good cry. It is a good cry. So I'm about to go to Five Guys because I miss my boyfriend and I miss like being with him. I'm very proud of him and I am emotional because I want to be there to support, like just to like physically show how proud I am because it has been weird like it's such a weird feeling but y'all let me get into it so i'm moving and i'm very excited but that's where a lot of my emotions has been like wrapped around this moving process has been it's been good i'm very grateful for this move i'm very grateful that i won't be in a long distance relationship anymore like i can i can actually like say with confidence I live with my boyfriend like I'm so excited for that moment I'm so excited and I've just been very like emotional thinking about all the things that I want to do with him when I get there wow like it's happening already but y'all I'm so excited to like not be in a long distance relationship anymore I'm so excited so excited Ooh. And that's why I'm going to Five Guys because that's like one of our favorite places to go and eat. So I'm going to go and get Five Guys and just think more about the things that I want to do when I move. But I'm very grateful. I'm very grateful. And I'm excited to be in a new state. Um, my boyfriend's from the Carolinas. But we're going to be in Georgia and I'm just really excited to like have weekends to go to the beach and stuff and be able to grow and all that like I'm just so excited and I'm like I'm sorry that it feels like I'm all over the place where I'm like I'm starting to cry and then it goes back to me talking like this like I'm happy I'm very happy very happy and I'm going to be over 10 hours away from my family here in Kentucky. But at the same time, y'all, like, my boyfriend is my family. He's my family. And it's not going to feel like I'm away from family, you know? Like, does that make sense? Like, when we were in school together that brought us closer to where it, it didn't really feel like a long distance relationship because we were at school but since we've both been graduated like the long distance has been hitting to where it's like we have to plan on like when am I gonna see you again all of that like all of my emotions is just it, it I don't know how, how to put it. it it feels like I'm, I'm getting closure in my relationship like it's it's gonna move into like like I get to see you tomorrow good night like what do you want to do when we wake up or like I'll meet you downstairs or like just different things like what do you want for dinner I know like I'm getting emotional like it sounds I know it probably 
like sound stupid that I'm getting excited for all of this. But I'm just so excited to experience being with him more. Cause like when he when he comes to visit for like a weekend or if he has something in Kentucky that he has to do and he comes up and stuff like it's just for that and there's not really a moment for us to like do things that we want to do like I feel like my birthday weekend when we were in Gatlinburg that was like a little glimpse of being with him every day but like I think the first the first time was when COVID hit and spring break was like an ex it was like the extended spring break he was in Kentucky with me for like over two weeks and it felt nice and then it was like really sad when he had to leave like it made sense though because it's like girl he has to go home <laughs> but yeah like we've we've been graduated and it's just it, it's been hard like the phone calls have been harder everything's been hard and like it's coming to a close I'm literally moving next month next week is a new month May is next week and I am moving I'm moving I'm leaving Kentucky I'm so excited though I'm so excited like I'm really leaving and I get to live with my boyfriend like that's crazy I get to start fresh I get to like meet his friends and like meet the people that he always talks about as well like I have to start new it's crazy it's so crazy but I'm so excited I'm so excited oh and I'm so grateful oh yeah y'all <laughs> I think that's all I wanted this video to be. Y'all can laugh at me. Because <laughs> I have to laugh at myself. Like, I'm crying for no reason. But, like, at the same time, I feel like I have to cry. Because it's been a long time coming. And I'm very grateful for this to be happening. But I can't be walking into five guys like this. Okay, yeah, because the Five Guys is literally down the road. Like, I'm two or three minutes away, so it's like, I need to tighten up before I'm crying <laughs> again. Like, oh, I've been holding this in for a minute. And I don't like crying at work. I do not like crying at work. The way work be moving, business at work, your personal business at work, Sometimes it be passed passed around like a blunt. <laughs> and I don't want to cry at work and be talked about like, oh, she's this, she's okay, she's emotional because she gets to be with her boyfriend soon. Da -da -da. No, so I've been holding these emotions in for a minute. Oh, but I'm so excited, y'all. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. If anybody is in a long distance relationship like me, I hope you get to this feeling of excitement moving with your boyfriend. And I also hope that you understand as well, like, why I'm emotional. <laughs> and also, I'd love some moving tips. Like, a, like different apartment things, maybe? I don't know. I might like go to TikTok to ask different questions on like moving moving ideas or advice or something cause it's not gonna be him moving this time like Kentucky wise it's gonna be us moving so I'm very excited I am very excited like it's not gonna be him coming up here this time it's gonna be me going down there and y'all, what's also crazy is like, the only times that I've been down south is to get like new tattoos. We're gonna be close.
close to the tattoo place like it's so crazy and, and then I get to see like different things that he, he's been wanting to do look and then I get to cry again because I'm just so excited like we'll be able to be together for his birthday and like we'll be able to celebrate holidays together like beach weekends like I said and we'll be able to like he'll be able to express himself like y'all my boyfriend has no tattoos no tattoos <laughs> and he wants one but like yeah honestly we'll get to a story time on that when he's comfortable because there's like a reason why we're moving but honestly I'm very grateful that we're moving quicker than what we planned for real like I'm very grateful and I'm very excited but yeah like we can get tattoos <laughs> not matching tattoos no but like I don't know I don't know but I'm so excited for it I just said I needed to tighten up <laughs> to go to get to five guys and I'll start crying again I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Uh, calm down, bitch. It's okay, bitch. <laughs> it's okay. Whoo, shit, y'all. I needed to cry, though. I needed to cry. I know that this was good for me. This was good for me. Okay. The parking lot is filling up now, so I'm going to go ahead and get before it gets a little busier again. But yeah, y'all, that's all I wanted to say. Enjoy y'all weekend. If I don't FaceTime y'all this weekend, I'll FaceTime y'all another time. Y'all already know. I don't know what my video schedules are. But um, yeah, y'all can laugh at me. Please laugh at me because I like if I got to cry, I'm going to cry and I'm going to video myself crying because somebody got got to get a laugh <laughs> my dramatic ass somebody got to get a laugh get fired up and will and will i got my little benjamin with me <laughs> where did benjamin come from did tiktok do that honestly do y'all believe the tiktok ban i don't believe it because who's taking it out my app or out my phone you know what I mean like some people still got flappy bird <laughs> okay y'all I'm rambling for real I feel better I just need to get a cry out and I feel comfortable crying <laughs> on the internet get it out there okay but yeah it's time to go get a veggie a veggie sandwich with extra onion extra green pepper no mushroom no tomato that's how I like it. Mm. Delicious. Looking thick. Love my fries drenching everything. I love it. Oh, I love Five Guys. Does Georgia have a Five Guys? I need to get used to my new state. <laughs>